today is the day that I'm moving. And there's Andrew back there. It's not just a random man in my bed. It is officially move-in day and I have not started packing and it's like 11 o'clock. Courtney was packed way earlier in the week and Caitlin packed two days in advance. And then there's me, I haven't started. Day of the moving. You know, I had to just do it in Taylor fashion, which is procrastinate. I just feel like packing. It doesn't take as long as you think it is gonna take. You just do it and then it's done. I can't wait to give you guys more details on the house, but today I'm just gonna be focusing on moving because I gotta get to that. Last night I kept dreaming about moving. It was confusing. It's 1.30 now. My dad and Andrew have been helping me the entire time. Thank you guys. It's kinda sad packing up my room, but I keep leaving a ton of stuff here so that I have stuff to wear when I'm coming home. I don't know if that's smart, but it's what I'm doing. Look at all this package, y'all. Package. Hmm. Anyway, it's getting real. <laughs> Ren! Come here. Oh, hi. I'm gonna meet you. Okay, this is my bean bag. We just moved up the stairs. Look how big it is. And then this is all my silverware, kitchen supplies that I've gathered. <gasps> Car is packed. We got fully ready in like three hours, which is crazy. I have no idea how we did it so fast, but I'm not complaining. I'm not gonna question it. Guys. Night one. Basically, I spent the entire day unpacking, obviously. <laughs> My mattress isn't in yet, so I'm using an air mattress. It's kind of cute. I kind of like her. I have my desk set up so I can work. I don't know why I did air quotes. I literally do have to work. I've been having mixed emotions the entire time. It feels weird not being home with my family, Ren and Andrew. It feels weird and I miss them. I'm all alone in my new apartment in a big city. They just dropped me off. Good morning. It's a brand new day and guys, look how freaking cute my room is. I walk in and there's just so much sunlight. Claudia is on her way over to see my new place right now and we're gonna go to brunch. We have speakers all over our house in every room. There they are. And we can play music across like the entire house and our rooftop deck. We have a rooftop deck too. We figured out how to do it. So I've just been playing music all morning and my mood is just so lifted and it's amazing. My mother. Uh-oh, don't show me. And we are shopping at Target, getting some supplies. One thing that I hate is when people say Target. <laughs> Don't say that. Don't. Now here's some footage of me putting some stuff away because I got absolutely no footage of me doing that earlier. Look at me organizing that closet. Look at me go. And then I put up these lights and had to completely redo it because it looked dumb. My couch and my mattress came in and I just wanna talk about it, okay? I got them from onestopbedrooms.com and let me just say, that is the end all be all for furniture shopping. Let's talk about the cloud couch. I was on TikTok and I saw this amazing cloud couch do and I went digging through the comments to find what website it was from and it was from One Stop Bedrooms. If you guys don't know, like the restoration hardware cloud couch is like $11,000 or something crazy like that. This couch is way more reasonably priced. I will link everything below. It feels like a cloud and it gets softer and softer with use, which is amazing too. Hands down, amazing. I'm super impressed with One Stop Bedrooms. Just know you don't need to break the bank buying restoration hardware cloud couch because you can get one from one stall bedrooms. And it is beautiful. Like, I am obsessed with it. Ooh, so cute. It's nice. It's nice to have somewhere to sit. I know. I've been on edge. <laughs> And let's talk about my mattress. So the mattress that I got is a limited edition, super plush. It's from Ashley Furniture, but One Stop Bedrooms, and both of them came together. So that's the great thing about it. You don't have to pay for separate delivery costs. It all can come together. It is actually the most amazing soft mattress I have ever slept on. This one does not come in a box. They'll bring it right up to your room and it's amazing. Courtney, <laughs> my roommate, she bought a $600 mattress. The second that I sat on it, it was so hard. And my I said, I was like, this is really firm. And she was like, oh, that's what I was worried about. And wherever she got it from, they don't even allow you to return it. So she has been storing that mattress downstairs and had to buy a brand new one. Big struggle, big struggle. You would never have to worry about that at one stop bedrooms. And this mattress that I got is one of the least returned mattresses because it's so amazing. I was just looking at the reviews the other day and it's all five stars. The first night that I slept on this mattress,
mattress. I went to bed around midnight and slept until 11 through all my alarms. If that doesn't show you how comfortable it is, I don't know what is. And my room, the sun comes right in in the morning. So just saying, it's amazing. Thank you again to One Stop Bedrooms for partnering with me on today's video. And let's continue on with the moving vlog. together we're about to go to trader joe's and home goods and get more stuff and i'm going to bring you guys along with me it's been super hard for me to film a lot because i've been you know moving it's a lot of boring tedious work but the place is really coming together so let's go no why on our way <laughs> there she goes <laughs> <laughs> Trigger warning jump scare. <laughs> okay, we're just rug shopping. These are 400. But 400. This is like way too big. Yeah. But it's a mix of neutral Whoa, and I do colors. like those colors. Yeah. It's really yeah. pretty. I got my very first grocery store purchase. Everything total was only $75. I just finished my first Trader Joe's shopping experience. I just want to show you guys some of the stuff I got. This cute pizza, peanut butter, really cool cauliflower jalapeno dip. And I bought just a single bell pepper to eat this with. Sometimes I don't really understand myself, but it's okay. And we got tzatziki and I got pita to go with it. I don't even like cucumber, but I love tzatziki and I love pickles. So I really should like cucumbers, but I don't. I just got some hot dogs for some easy eating. You know what I'm saying? I love myself some beef sometimes. Ganaki? Ganaki. Gnoc, gnocchi, don't know. I got a bunch of burritos. I want to eat one of these tonight. Butter, cool. Should I just try some of this tzatziki dip right now? Let's do it. That just squirted on me. I'm not even gonna toast it. I'm just gonna go right in because I'm so hungry. I've literally been here for a while. This is my first time grocery shopping. Mmm, we love a grocery haul. Only four pitas. Mistake number one, I went grocery shopping while hungry. I bought so many random things. Whatever. Got some baby avocados, chunky salsa, green dragon hot sauce, and pesto. Andrew's sister always gets these and they're so good, guys. Get them. Yeah. Cereal, oats, ghost pepper potato chips. You guys know I love eggs. So I'm getting ready for bed. I just did my little curl thing. I just recorded a reel and a TikTok. I'll post them both so you can check that out if you want to see the tutorial on this. All my socials are linked below. I'm about to get ready for bed and I just added these LED strip lights to my bed. I didn't take them yet, okay? So don't judge me. They're just sitting right here. I need to tape them underneath so that it just makes the underglow. But I think I'm gonna do it because it's so cute. These are both the Fiat Smart bulbs and you can make them any color you want which is really cool so i love it and here's how my leds look i mean the more that i'm here the more excited i get about the fact that i'm living here i love my home so far like it's coming together better than i thought it would and it's not even a weekend and everything is so freaking cute uh, i will see you tomorrow <laughs> I had to take pictures for Instagram. It was so easy to just go outside and take pictures. It's crazy. Anyway, I'm gonna eat this now. So Andrew got to see the place for the first time. 
I did. It's so pretty. You like it? Yeah, it's so pretty. I haven't even given them the full tour yet, so. It's almost as pretty as my reflection. <laughs> and girlfriend. Oh God, yeah, Andrew. New yes. house. We are actually leaving now. I'm gonna take Andrew back home. She forgot to film the whole time. We've had a fun like three days here. So. I see you liked it? Yes. I don't like that you were farther away from me. Make that clear. <laughs> but aesthetically the house, very nice. I just zoned out so hard on that yellow door. Me too. Oh my god. I'm staring at it too. Mm -hmm. It's very modern and clean. Feels like like a hotel. It's somewhere I would love to have a studio. Dude, every time we see any house that has a cool room, or any house in general, that I'd like to have a studio here. It's just a nice vibe in here. Gonna take him home now. Lot to do this week. I guess I've officially been here one week. The to-do list is get a dining room. The to-do to the to-do list is get a dining room table and get some curtains because literally you can see right through my windows at night. And I don't want a you slash Joe stalker situation. That's terrifying. No Joe Goldberg stuff in here. Bye! You want to say bye, Andrew? Bye, Andrew. Okay. Hey guys, welcome to my bedroom. I just wanted to come on here and give a little update. It's been like a week and a half now that I've been moved in. Just the more and more I love it. <laughs> The fact that this place is mine, it doesn't it doesn't register yet. That doesn't make sense to me. My brain is like, that can't be real. I have noticed I like want everything to be perfect. I think that's because I feel like the most responsible for everything. <laughs> okay, we were supposed to have a water filter in our fridge, but everything is literally on back order for like ever because of COVID. I had to find one on Best Buy with my mom and, I, and we thought it had a filter, but it didn't have a water thing. So I was filling up the bread together day and I'm carrying it back to the fridge and I ran into the fridge door and dented it already. See, me caring about this stuff and me being the clumsy person that I am is not a good combination. Not. Update on my bed. I'm obsessed with it. I love it. If you guys need a mattress, you seriously need to go to One Stop Bedrooms because they have the perfect mattress for you. And I think it's limited edition. So yeah, I mean, I was thinking about it. Like mattresses, you really are spending one third of your life on it. And so invest in a good mattress. It's, it's worth it. And this one's perfect. Oh, and okay, I added the lights underneath my bed. My bedroom at night, it just has this whole different vibe now. I had to zip tie this thing to the bed frame because the material wasn't sticking good. Last time I updated about my like light strips, they looked so stupid because they weren't to the underneath part and it looked ridiculous. So I have to show you guys now that it looks good. It is literally glowing. And check this out. I can do whatever I want to it. All from my app. I like that, the contrasting colors. And this is all using the Fiat Electric app. It's like a little nightclub. I'm gonna get ready for bed. I have so much that I have to do tomorrow. The final reveal of my house is coming soon. But until then, good night. And I hope you have a great day. Sleep time. I think this is gonna be my new filming window. We put on a cute background for you guys. Some jellyfish, do you like that? <laughs> I think it's cute. How long have I been here? I've not updated this moving vlog in like a few weeks, maybe. I guess this will be the last update of the video. Guys, I love it here. I eat healthier. I feel like I have more time to get so much stuff done. I'm being an independent adult and paying for my own life, which is really liberating. And it's designed exactly how I want it. I'm just really happy. <laughs> As you could tell, like in the beginning of this video, I was more like, oh, this is a weird feeling. That lasted one day and now I'm chilling. I've been home a few times. I had my birthday, birthday vlog coming soon. And I decided that since we still have a mattress in the dining room and we don't have our dining room table yet, I am going to do a full house tour video and it will be hopefully the next video that I post. And that's where you guys will get a full tour of everything and it will actually be almost complete. I don't want it to be half done. Like I want it to be done. So yeah, but I'm sure you guys could see like a lot of different areas during this video anyway. So you get a lot of sneak peeks. I hope it holds you over until the next video. I just couldn't be happier. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it all the way to the end, comment OMG and then I'll know that you're a real one. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you have a fabulous day and I will see you soon. Bye.